Health from Huda TV. Sleep, this beautiful and pleasurable event that happens to all mankind and almost all other creatures. Allah has mentioned sleep in Quran in several uh, places, in several verses. In Surah uh, Ar-Rum, Allah says, uh, وَمِنْ آيَاتِهِ مَنَامُكُمْ بِاللَّيْلِ وَالنَّهَارِ which is, uh, could be translated as and amongst his uh, miracles is your sleep during night and during daytime. And in another verse in Surah uh, An-Naba, Allah says, وَجَعَلْنَا نَوْمَكُمْ ثُبَاتًا which could be have made your sleep as a method of rest. And it has been mentioned in any, many other areas and, and, and verses in Quran uh, saying that sleep is a great miracle and a great blessing for us. Uh, today we're talking about sleep and the problems that happen to us during sleep. With us is Dr. Mustafa Shaui, uh, consultant of pulmonary diseases at Ain Shams University. Welcome Dr. Mustafa. Welcome Dr. Ahmed. This, uh, this episode about sleep, I'm sure, yes. that would be very interesting to many of our viewers because uh, nowadays many people do have problems with sleeping. Yes. And uh, to start with, why is sleep important to us? First, <coughs> uh, I will begin from your word, it's a miracle. Sleep is a miracle from, the, I mean, from Allah. Yes. Uh, to relax, to relax our body because we all the all during the, all the day we have massive activity. Brain is working, heart is working, uh, but so, uh, as a machine, uh, our body as a machine, it has to relax. Yes. And sleep is been the only mechanism we can relax by, by this mechanism. During sleep, relaxation of the man muscles, and there is a lot of a physiological change which I mean occur uh, during sleep to restore our energy. To second day yes oh, physiological changes what are the physiological changes that happen there is uh, we studied the sleep and we studied the physiological events which occur during uh, sleep time uh, first increase there is uh, we find there is increase in the blood flow to the brain mm -hmm. uh, increase the level of the hormone uh, which is responsible for growth of our body, mm -hmm. uh, which can, by measuring the levels of the growth hormone, it's increased during night, is, uh, especially in the children. Yes. Uh, during sleep, uh, there is gradual decrease in the heart rate because mm -hmm. we have a nerve in the body which is called the vagus nerve responsible for decreasing the heart rate. Yes. Also, the blood pressure. The blood pressure is lower during sleep than uh, during daytime. Mm -hmm. uh, fortunately, also, uh, if patient with any type of arrhythmia, we found this arrhythmia is minimally during sleep, and this is uh, good for uh, for this patient. Yes. Uh, respiratory, as regarding respiratory system or items, there is decrease in the respiratory rate, relaxation of the lung. Uh, decrease in minute, what's called minute ventilation. Mm -hmm. uh, all of this uh, just to restore our energy to the second day. That's very good. So, uh, the blessing of sleep, many of people don't really enjoy it yes. because they have uh, sleep disorder. As we said, uh, what, what could cause sleep disorders? Look, uh, Dr. Ahmad, uh, we have a statistics, uh, uh, for example, in USA, we found that about 180, 180 million people suffering from disorder in the sleep. That's a huge number. Yes, people. it's yes. Uh, sleep disorder, uh, you have different uh, type of uh, sleep disorder. Mm -hmm. uh, we have what's called uh, dysomnias. Uh, we can divide it, it's what's called obstructive sleep apnea. Yes. Uh, sleep apnea, which apnea, what means uh, a cessation of breathing during the sleep, uh -huh. uh, more, more than 10 seconds. Mm. Uh, it is caused uh, secondary to which occurs, secondary to the obstruction of the upper airway. Mm -hmm. The center, what's called central sleep apnea, secondary isn't it, uh, due to uh, relax, uh, sedation or uh, diminished activity of respiratory system uh, in the brain. 
Uh, also, there is another type of sleep uh, disorder breathing, uh, hypo, what's called hypoventilation syndrome. Yes. Some people who, which, uh, who are uh, obese complaining of uh, some sort of hypoxia, uh, which means a decrease in oxygen level during sleep. Mm -hmm. And this is a dangerous process. Definitely. Uh, yes. Uh, another type of uh, sleep disorder, uh, uh, especially in the children, uh, what's called uh, nocturnal enuresis. Yes. Uh, it's, 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 they they nicturate while, while being asleep. Asleep, yes. It's more common in the children. Yes. Uh, or something uh, what's called... We yeah. have, uh, uh, have patients uh, walking during sleep and it's unconsciousness. This is true, not just in the movies. No, it's uh, true. It's, it's uh, true. true. It's a psychiatric problem. Yes. Uh, we should, we, we, it's a dangerous problem. It should be managed uh, idly. So we're talking about sleep apnea in this episode uh, yes. in particular. So uh, get us more closer to what happens during sleep apnea. I have a video here, a small video here we can see. Yes. Uh, in this video, to show us what, what happened during sleep. In patient with mean sleep apnea syndrome, uh, is it something difficult? Okay. As we see here, a patient with mean sleep apnea, mm -hmm. he's breathing now. And yes. there is apnea, now it's apnea, no flow. So suddenly uh, awakened from the sleep uh -huh. because of choking. Yes. And he is uh, awoken enough from the sleep. And then will he will sleep again. Yes. Yes. Okay. Uh -huh. Another type, we continue, there will be another attack of uh, sleep ap apnea, yes. Oh, yes, there it is. That's it. Uh -huh. And awoken from the sleep. Uh, these figures show this mean the flow of the air, stoppage of the air, yes. uh, uh, from the f stoppage of the air, mm -hmm. and abnormal, this abnormal, this will lead to abnormal accumulation of uh, carbon dioxide level, which awaken from the patient from the sleep. Mm -hmm. uh, this type of apnea is called what's called obstructive sleep apnea. So there is obstruction of the yes. air. Upper going, airway, upper of the upper yes. airway from going into the lungs. This is the lung. Yes. Yes. Uh, there are many factors which cause this obstruction. Simply, there are what's called uh, tonsil uh, hypertrophy. Yes. We have the tonsils. Uh, if hypertrophy, they will close the upper airway, or mm -hmm. or uh, what's called adenoid hypertrophy. Also, mm -hmm. enlargement of the adenoid adenoid gland, especially in the children, or abnormality in the nose. Mm -hmm. If there is deviation of the nasal septum or obstruction, nasal obstruction by any causes. Yes. Co all of this le leading to the obstruction of the airway during sleep. Yes. Okay. Uh, of the uh, upper, uh, uh, the upper um, uh, soft, what's called soft palate. Yes. Yes. All of this causing obstruction of the air during sleep. Mm -hmm. So when some person has sleep problem or sleep apnea, um, what do they experience? Uh, we, we saw in the video the person was sleeping. He has yeah. some difficulty in, uh, in, in breathing, in breathing but still he, he's sleeping. No, um, but he, he, he gets uncomfortable sleeping because yes. he's awakened several times during night. Uh -huh. And uh, this is one of the cause of the, uh, when he awakened in the morning, he, he looks, uh, he not takes that enough time for the sleeping. He sleep, uh, yes, he sleep, but it's uncomfortable sleep. Yes, some, some people would have uh, snoring uh, while sleeping. Is that yeah. related to sleep apnea? Sure, sure. Snoring is one of the key symptoms of the mean obstructive sleep apnea. And I have a short, uh, I have a video here. Yes. Showing how the snoring, how snoring occur. During passage of the air, there will be vibration of the upper airway. Mm -hmm. As we see here, mm -hmm. there will be vibration of the soft palate during mm -hmm. passage of the air. Yes. Uh, uh, this occurs in obese patients with which ha who have uh, hypertrophy. As as you, as you see here, uh -huh. there will be vibration now. Yes, that's it. Uh, that's this the, vibration, yeah. which causes the sound which uh, we heard during sleep. Mm -hmm. Okay, snoring one, snoring sure is one of the key symptoms of the uh, obstructive sleep apnea. 
We ask the pet partner to the patient. We don't ask the patient because he's no, he doesn't auscultate himself. We ask, we ask the pet partner if he's snoring play, uh, during night, sh she or he will say yes. Uh -huh. So this, this uh, is being inflicted not only on the patient, but no, also... No, pet partner. Yes, yeah, so the sleep apnea is, is a disease of the family. Husband. The whole yes, family. It's a family problem. Yeah. That's one of the co It's uh, snoring by itself is one of the causes of the deforested in Egypt or in Arab world. Yes. So w when, when somebody comes to you, because I'm sure that many people do not have the, the idea that this, this could be treated. They just live all their lives feeling tired, not yes. getting enough sleep, and they just go on like this. They don't have the, uh, the, uh, the idea that this could be treated and this could be dealt with and there's a cure for the problem. Yes. But for those who would come and know that there's a problem, yes. how, would they, how would you investigate and, or how would you manage yes. the, the case? First, we take the history from the, this patient or his, uh, his wife or her husband mm -hmm. uh, to know the symptoms. If they, we ask the, uh, the pet partner if he has a snoring during sleep, mm -hmm. Or, uh, or care uh, if he has apnea during sleep. What's, uh, what's uh, apnea means a stoppage of the breathing for 10 seconds, about 10 seconds, then regain of the breathing by a case of hyper, hyper hyperventilation, rapid breathing. Mm -hmm. And this occurs frequently during night. Uh, according to the degree of the obstruction which occurs with apnea and the attack of apnea, we can diagnose it. Uh, a case of uh, mild or moderate or severe bronchial asthma. Uh, we ask the symptoms. Uh, as we said, uh, snoring is one is a key symptoms. Second type is morning daytime sleepness. Yes, it's, it's, it's one of the main problem, one yes. symptoms. Yes, he sleep uh, sleep while watching TV or while sitting in the car in uh, pass a stop. Yes, or, yes, uh, or during walking uh, or during uh, or during uh, uh, reading a book, he will fall asleep. That's, that's a this big problem and, and could cause lots of uh, daytime difficulties. Yes, difficulties in life. Uh, uh, yes. We'll be talking about this more. We have a short break, brothers and sisters. Uh, we'll be back, inshallah, to talk about this uh, problem about sleeping. So please stay tuned. Until then, assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah.